Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Wisconsin Wonder Garden. We're down here at the aquaponic grow bed, and I'll tell you one thing, half of you are gonna think I'm absolutely crazy for what I'm about to do to one of our pepper plants. Why on earth did I just cut my pepper plant in half? Ladies and gentlemen, that is called topping. It is where you basically prune your pepper plants. Many of you are actually unaware that peppers are not annuals. Peppers are actually perennials and can grow year round, especially in an aquaponic center like this when you're indoors. What does topping do and why do we do it? Well. When I cut the top of this plant off, what it does is forces new growth among these leaves and stems here, and it basically it improves the strength of your root system, your base stem, and all of your other shoots that are gonna be coming off of this plant. So really quick and simple, what we did here is we forced this growth down into the main stem and into the other shoots. What this will do is it will actually produce a really good yield for us throughout the entire year. And believe it or not, you can keep on trimming this off and cutting it as you get peppers produced and new shoots will form producing even more peppers. It's absolutely incredible. It's something that I had never thought about before or even knew existed until about sometime last year. So I'm very excited to finally get to try it since I'm growing indoors. What I will be doing is documenting this plant here and then this plant over here that I will not be topping whatsoever. I will let it grow out to the full capacity and see what kind of a yield I get from it and then I will continue to document the yield from this plant. Well, I do expect this one that is not topped to produce fruit a little bit quicker and sooner than the one that I will be topping but the one that I will be topping will provide me a nice strong sturdy wide spread out plant that gathers a lot of this light and produces wonderful healthy extremely nutritional food so this experiment is going to be ongoing probably for the next uh six months to a year for sure um i'll be documenting this one until i get my fruit and then i'll probably trim it and everything too eventually uh but I want you guys to stay tuned for this to see what goes on when you top your pepper plants and um, it will help you realize maybe this is something that you guys can do in your gardens if you're growing indoors or a greenhouse where you can produce food year round. Because once again, a pepper plant is a perennial. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all are having an awesome, wonderful summer so far. The summer just kicked off. We're having beautiful weather, lots of rain over here in Wisconsin, which is good. The plants need that this time of year, so hopefully that continues. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe, comment down below if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, or if you've done this before, let me know what your results were. Take care, guys. Thanks for watching.